Hello, amazing champions. I welcome you all to class. Today, we'll be looking at a few topics. But well, first of all, let's begin with how we can use to, to, and to. To is used to show direction. It is also used before a verb. For example, Kim wanted to help. To mean excessively too much. To means also or as well. To is always a number. For more information on how we can make use of to, to and to, kindly watch this video. Have fun. To, spelled T-O, is a preposition or part of an infinitive. As a preposition, to is used to indicate direction or motion. Let's look at some examples. I'm going to a restaurant tonight. I'll be at the cinema from 9 to 11. Can you give my phone number to Jeff? To is also part of a verb infinitive and comes before the verb. I need to have a nap. I want to go to town. I love to shop. To have, to go, and to shop are all verb infinitives. Now let's look at to, spelled T-O-O. To -O. functions as an adverb and means also, or it can mean excessively or in excess. Let's look at some examples. I like country music, too. I want ice cream, too. These examples mean, I also like country music, or I also want ice cream. I ate too much ice cream. I am too tired to go to the party. These examples mean, I ate more ice cream than I should have. And I am very tired, so I can't go to the party. Now let's look at two, spelled T-W-O, which is the easiest of them all. Two is the number that comes between one and three. Examples. I have two blue eyes. We can only stay at the party for two hours. Now let's look at a few examples combining these words. I am going to the party, too. I have two sisters, too. I ate too much pizza tonight. Now Welcome back. We move on to your and your. Use your to show possession. For example, is this your house? Use the contraction your when you mean you are. For example, you're sure to have a great time at the beach. For more information on the difference between your and your, kindly watch this video. Have fun. Your, your. In this lesson, we are going to learn the difference between these two words and how to use each in a sentence. Your. This is an adjective, specifically a possessive adjective. And it refers to something that belongs to the person being spoken to. For example, we can use this in a question. Is that your laptop? Here we're asking if the laptop belongs to that person. Another example is, I love your shoes. Your garden is huge. Your this is a contraction of you are. For example, you're so funny. Here, 
The sentence would still make sense if we said, you are so funny. However, we've shortened the words, you are, to your. Another example is, you're a brilliant teacher. Call me when you're free. Welcome back. Now let's look at the difference between here and here. Here has an ear in it. It means to know a sound is made. It means to listen. For example, I hear the dog barking. Here means in this place. It means where you are. For example, I am staying here until noon. For more information on the difference between here and here, ensure you watch this video. Enjoy. Here, spelled H-E-R-E, -E, is an adverb and means in, at, or to this place or position. Let's look at some examples. Come here, John. Look at this cute dog over here. I go to school here. Do you live here? Turn right here. Here can also be used when introducing something or someone. Examples I can't find my keys. Never mind, here they are. Here is an example. Here's the money I owe you. Here, spelled H-E-A-R, is a verb and means to detect or perceive sound made by someone or something with your ears. The past form of here is heard. Let's look at some examples. I can't hear you because I am walking on a busy street. Do you hear that noise? I can't hear the music. Please turn it up. Here also means to be told something or informed about something. I hear that you got a new job in France. I heard he had a fight at the bar last night. Did you hear that I broke up with Joe? Now let's read some examples using both here and here. I hear that you live here now. Did you hear that Jane started working here in our department? Here is Grandma's hearing aid. Welcome back. Finally, let's look at how we can make use of there there and there. Use there when referring to a place. Use there to show possession. Use the contraction there when you mean they are. For example, I am sure they're going to be late. For more information on how to make use of there, there, and there, kindly watch this video. Enjoy! There, spelled T-H-E-R-E, -E, is used to show place. Where's the cat? There it is. It's on the table. you are. I was looking for you everywhere. There is also used for there is and there are to say something exists. There is a slide in the park. There are lots of children in my class.
they're spelled T-H-E-Y apostrophe R-E is short for they are. What are they? They're dinosaurs. Thank you for the flowers. They're beautiful. What are the dogs doing? They're barking. There, spelled T-H-E-I-R, means belonging to them. It's a possessive adjective from the group my, your, his, her, its, our, their. The boys are riding their bikes. Tom and Jenny live here. It's their house. The hens are sitting on their eggs. Okay, we have come to the end of this lesson. I'm sure you had so much fun and of course you learned a lot. Thank you for watching. Ensure you attempt your quiz. Have a lovely day. Bye.